Hi, uh, today I'm going to show you uh, how to design the uh, base spray uh, vertical brace using our program Silver Bay uh, Steel Connection Design. So uh, I start the web browser, I use Opera here, type in the address asp.silverbay.com slash connect. Connect, okay, enter, and you get an interface which is what we uh, have in my previous tutorial for the um, Chevron brace all right so now we are going to design the um, uh, base plate vertical brace so go to brace connection go to here uh, for we will choose uh, vertical brace base plate okay so uh, that's uh, a quite common uh, type of brace okay um, that uh, uh, brace to uh, colon strong axis. All right. Uh, okay. Uh, looks like uh, something is not right here. We want to turn the uh, gas spray off. Turn the stiffener spray off. Okay. All right. So probably uh, we're going to okay. We'll keep it this way. All right. And uh, let's say the angle is now is forty degree. Okay, that's fine. Okay. So the way we uh, distribute the uh, gas spray interface force is using uniform force uniform force method. Uh, their example we follow this AIC design guide twenty nine. Okay. Vertical brace connection, uh, design guide 29. There is a base plate, a uh, couple of fine base plate, base plate. Uh, okay, brace connection to column base plate. Uh, the uh, page 37, 37, 37 here. Where is it? Okay, 32. Thirty six, okay, thirty seven. Here is to call on uh, strong X six, okay, design guide twenty nine, strong X six. We follow this way, okay, to dispute the force. That's how we did, and to call on V X six, all right. So, uh, to to understand how our limit state check, how our program provider check, referred to uh, AIC design guide twenty nine. Uh, to check these uh, page uh, 38 for uh, cassette to column uh, strong axis and page uh, 39 for cassette to column V axis. Okay, that's where we follow. Now, so again, uh, you can choose the, the column strong axis, French, okay, uh, or to column uh, V axis, V axis, web, okay. And uh, let's say to call on weak back six, right? And uh, that one, we want to go flat uh, 90 degrees, so you just uh, click on gas set to call on the web uh, to be uh, you copy the subject value here, okay? Copy the subject value here, okay? Here you go. Okay, so it defined the web, see the highlight text, okay, and the gas set to base plate, okay. Okay, you can set, let's derive web, okay, derive web, set the well size, okay. These are uh, play width, left and right, uh, you can, let's suggest value, okay, you can copy it. Copy the address value, okay. All right, so that's base plate. Uh, you can define, see the highlight text, okay, here. See the highlight text, uh, left and right, uh, left and right. You can uh, define the left and right to be different uh, dimension. And eccentric, let's follow design guide 29. We start from, uh, we treat this one as a uh, work point. 
and uh, go downward the eccentric uh, is minus one uh, one inch if the plate is one inch thick okay so normally we get one point to the underside of the base all right so that's why uh, we get these uh, eccentric base work point. That's design guide 29 approach. You refer to design guide 29, you will know that. Okay. And one thing I like to highlight the clearance. Okay, gas plate. That's clearance. Okay, so. Uh, that's clearance. It's this one. See the highlight? Okay, the clearance to, to call in uh, French. Okay. Uh, one thing I'd like to highlight is that uh, that's a uh, gas set to call an weak axis case and gas set to then go to gas set to uh, call an strong axis case, okay, French, S strong axis case and uh, now uh, we go to gas set to base play Cassette to base spray. All right. And see uh, this tiny word length here. Okay. We can copy uh, suggest value here. Okay. Tiny uh, web length here. Um, normally, um, that's not adequate. All right. So we like for for these uh, brace to call and strong axis. We uh, no normal way we uh, specify longer base plate length on the on this side so we allow to be see the left highlight text allowed to be uh, different width uh, left or no, and right of uh, column center line so that's uh, to 12 inch here okay so we have uh, non-symmetric unsymmetric uh, uh, base plate uh, size between left and right, okay, 12 inch. That's one way we handle it, okay. Then pedestal size should be uh, accommodate this one, should accommodate this one. So that one will work, so, okay. Uh, that's the base plate, uh, brace to strong axis, okay. If one is flat, you can go to uh, Gasa to Colon and copy, all right. So go to design load. Okay, design load again. We provide uh, your option of two load cases. Okay, one for maximum comp tensile, one for maximum compression. Okay, the negative value uh, denotes tensile, positive value denotes compression. Okay, two low cases. Okay, so now you get 0 0.63. That's not bad. So go to design calc. Uh, we select all. Select all, okay. We get the uh, all right. We expand all, okay. All the detail, and print it, okay. So that's a nice sketch summary, okay, and. Uh, Gas brace to current strong axis, a gas of view with weak more section. Okay, all of the mistake check okay, for, for two low cases, all right? One for maximum tensile, one for maximum compression, okay? So that follow design guide 29, all of the mistake check, okay? So that concludes my tutorial on uh, brace uh, to base plate. Uh, vertical brace to base plate okay we'll go to the next one uh, uh, knee brace all right thank you